Good morning. Today is October 1st, 2022, and I have a quick game for you. This is a technique where if I'm facing a very strong player and I don't want to go into technical details over here, uh, I want to basically try to clarify the position as soon as possible. So I try to go into the ending stage as fast as possible. So this is how it goes. This is a uh, four nights games Italian variation. Uh, first thing over here. Uh, oh, by the way, before I do that, we need to do the puzzles, right? So let's do the puzzles over here. Here's the position number one right here. The queen has just uh, captured a pawn on e5. What should I do? Next puzzle, queen has just moved, uh, captured a pawn on b2. What should I do? All right, so let's go to the opening over here. Four nights, very, four nights game, Italian variation. Quite sensible, basically. Uh, normal opening but remember I want to go into ending ASAP so basically try to trade as many pieces as possible so that's trading just keep trading and trading and trading and trade so basically all you got to do is you know all what happens is basically that's that's position but that's the position basically and it's the ending already uh, yes there are some pawns in the center over here uh, but otherwise it's just queen and bishop right there so once the pawn is liquidated once pawns in the center is liquidated that's it that's the ending like we, we go into the ending phase like immediately so there's a pawn over here, pawn move over here. So this is kind of a complication right here. And that's a thing over here. Black move over here, right? But black could have move over here right, as well. And opening up attack on the queen. If black does that, I would have moved the queen here and trying to threaten that one and then black can go out here or there and basically have a good game but black did not do good there so so this is puzzle number one and this is the answer pop right here and suddenly i win an exchange right there so that's the answer for here unfortunately unfortunately that's what I did. <laughs> so, no, I didn't do that. I did not do the pin over there. Fortunately, Black is totally ignorant about that and that. So, I did that one. Anyway, win the exchange. Uh, pop again right there. Just keep trading positions. Uh, threatening this pawn right here. Just keep. Just keep liquidating the pawns, basically. That's what I... Pinning the pin, uh, pinning the pawn over there. And this is puzzle number two. The queen has just captured the pawn on B2. What should I do? And this is the answer to the puzzle. Bishop takes queen. Black resign. And that's it. So... That's a nice quick game. Uh, Black makes a couple blunders where the second one is fatal. So that's about it. Anyway, that's the game for today. Now I'm going to make some announcements here. Basically, if you're a subscriber, that's five of you at, the, at this time, you're going to realize that, hey, today's uh, YouTube is, today's video is basically coming up late. Usually I publish this at 10 o'clock here, it's after 1 o'clock and it's still 
not up yet. So there's a there's a reason for it. The reason for it is because I was overwhelmed basically. Couldn't get couldn't get the process fast enough. And so I'm gonna make some changes basically. Uh, I basically streamlined the operation and try to make as many videos in advance as possible. Now with chess game I actually have several over here. There's uh, I decided to make a changing where the program, where the good games is going to be put on Sunday. So on Sunday, you're going to have a good game. Uh, the, the, uh, the brilliant game, the, the, the really, really good game, the really, really interesting and fun game. Uh, the other days, Monday to Saturday, is going to be reserved into good games, good puns. And maybe there's a couple average games which some, I sometimes do. Uh, and so it's not guaranteed to be great. But when I did a kilo chess, I like it a lot. Say, hey, you want to see something special? Go to Sunday. And that's what I decided to do. I decided to just push the brilliant games on Sunday now. So I have several right, right here. There's uh, Bishop Power, uh, Guess the Yellow. There's uh, Can Opener Rook. There's the Queen is and Price, and there's a couple that says the computer is wrong, where I totally ignore what the computer suggestion is. So uh, those are all going to be done on Sunday. Other days, just standard game, I suppose, standard good games. Obviously, if it's bad game, I'm not going to put that one up. So another change, change uh, number two over here, is that the games is going to be turned into blitz games. Right now, with chess.com, I'm doing what's called a rapid game, which is 10 minutes. Lately, I've been going with a blitz game, which is 3 minutes, 3 minutes game, 3 plus 2, so you, you, I don't run out of time, basically. So, there's a couple times where uh, I almost run out of time, like 15 seconds, and it would I would get a warning, so then I start moving rapidly and make all kinds of blunders. But so that's not a change over there, uh, over there. And the third one over here is that I'm thinking of, you know, I'm doing all these games, I'm doing all these puzzles. It would be a pity if people see it once and never go back to it. I certainly feel the need of going back to all my previous puzzles so I do not forget the lessons which I notice I sometimes do. So I'm thinking maybe I should write a puzzle book or something, compile a bunch of puzzles and put it into a book. So let me know what you think about that. And if you think that's a good idea, uh, let me know about it and I'll start to seriously consider about doing it. Anyway, that's it for today. Thank you for watching and I'll see you tomorrow.